Yeah, I'm excited. And you know what? A, a lot of times if you had the Boston Celtics, yeah. there would be a good percentage of this place they that would be curses. Celtics fans. I don't see any green, and just now they got booed when they were introduced. Right now, the lights are out. Fans have their phones out. There are uh, some blue lights above all the walkways that enter the arena. There's a blue light on midcourt. Here's Olivier. The next video that will start things out to introduce the starting lineups. I'll describe the video. There's some computer animation. There's a James Harden highlight, a Kevin Durant highlight, outdoor highlights of Barkley Center. James Harden knocking down a long jumper. Now, this isn't great to describe this. It's hard to do. Nah. To describe a hype video. But, Capper, in a moment, Olivier is going to address the crowd. He'll introduce the starting lineup. You'll hear from the people and give you a little taste of what it's like to be in Barclays. Yeah, yeah, well, once again, though, the game presentation people at the Nets, this is something special for the playoffs. And I'm telling you, it is as cool as it comes. Level up is the theme for the Brooklyn Nets playoffs. The Nets, who won five straight games to end the regular season, finished 24 games over 500 for the first time in franchise history. They had the best winning percentage in franchise history. They were 28-8 at home, and here's Olivia. This is your 35. At four, six, ten from Texas. Barkley Center. Cap, I can go out there and get 20 right now. Yeah. I I'm telling you right now, I can go get 20. Just on being all pumped up. I right? am pumped just, up. Just, I'm ready to go. It's just so great to, to just have the energy back, have everything going on and what we've all been through over the last year. To be here with this many people, to have the big three and the Nets and the playoffs and the Celtics, this is awesome. All right, let's get to the game at hand now, Capper. Let's get your keys to the game. Brought to you by Honda, the official automotive partner of Barclays Center of the Brooklyn Nets. Well, certainly the big, big three meshing together, not deferring to each other early on. And to see the kind of flow they have offensively, I think, would be uh, of big importance. Nets, you heard from Steve Nash just in your pregame interview. How can the Nets get beaten this game two ways? Offensive rebounding by the Celtics. They're really good at it. One of the top five in the NBA. And the Nets are really bad at rebounding the ball defensively. So you can't afford to give up extra shots to a team that you're better than. And the other thing is Nets better defend the three-point line. It's the great equalizer. And Kemba Walker, Evan Fournier, not just Tatum, have shot the ball very, very well lately. And the Nets got to be wary of them. That's, that's how they could hang in the game with extra shots and three-pointers made. Celtics were 10th in the league in three-point percentage this year at 37.4%. Of course, the Nets, they were at historic levels offensively. They had the best offensive rating in NBA history at 117.3. Second most points per game in the NBA and the most all-time in franchise history at 118.6 per game. They led the league in field goal percentage for the first time. The second highest three-point percentage in franchise history. Nets are in black. Their traditional black uniform. White letters and numbers. Brooklyn in a simple font, arched across the chest. The Celtics in their classic Kelly Green with the white letters and numbers. Boston in a simple font. 
marched across the chest. Here we go. Next in Celtics. Game one of the NBA playoffs. It'll be Tristan Thompson and Kevin Durant in the center circle. Durant wins the tip. And we're underway here at Barclays Center. James Harden plays into the backcourt. Moves right to left into the front court. Gives up high to Griffin. Played by Thompson. Angling right. Switches back left. Hands to Kyrie Irving. Back to a rolling Griffin. Could handle the pass. Try to save it, but turned it over. Celtics in control. Left to right of the front court. Kemba Walker out of the Bronx. Down the lane. Twisting shot. No good. Harden with a rebound for Brooklyn. Harden now into the front court. Harden stops top of the yard. Played by Thompson. Low crossover. Step back three. No good. In and out. Rebounded by the Celtics. Down that first possession, how quick Kemba Walker is again, Chris. He's, he's, all, he's over all those injuries he's had. Both teams relatively healthy, although the Celtics without Jalen Brown. Cross-court pass on the left wing, and Marcus Smart stepped out of bounds along that far sideline, which is now...